Only reason I'm scared to let my son speak out publicly is because the trolls are so evil. I really wish I had a way that my son could send a private message to his daddy because he got some shit he want to say. But I'm scared that if I put it out there publicly, like, it's going to hurt him personally. You know what I mean? Because people be saying a lot of mean, evil shit. That's why I don't be letting him be on here by himself. I want to get in touch with his daddy. I don't even really care about everything else. And not that his daddy going to make him do whatever he... Um, do whatever he say or anything but maybe he can have that conversation with him think about it your daddy was locked up 26 years pretty much your whole life you don't know what the fuck be uh, you know what i mean you never really had a daddy to know how to be a daddy so i get it you're struggling we all make mistakes life kind of go on at this point but maybe if you and your daddy can have that conversation break the generational curse or whatever you can make shit right with my son. I'm not ever going to deny him of that because my child feelings is involved. My child feelings is involved. It ain't about me. People can say I'm making myself look stupid or whatever they want to say all day long, but at the same time, I'm fighting for my son. When I was young, I didn't have this. My mama and them didn't give a fuck about me, and that's cool. That's cool. So I know I don't want to be anything like them, so I'm going to go hard for mine all the time, like I always do. And I just feel like a motherfucker should do the right thing. That's all I'm saying. So if y'all could get the message across the line, y'all know how y'all do. Y'all know y'all resources and all of that. I just feel like, please, just, you know. Thank you, thank you. And that's what I'm saying. I'm not on here to see if people going to say if I'm doing the right thing or not. You know what I'm saying? If whoever mad about how the fuck I'm handling my situation, y'all don't have to be here. Y'all don't have to be here. Y'all are hearing what I'm saying because I'm saying it on here, but I'm not sending the message to y'all. The message is to who it needs to go to. And whether they listening or not, I'm just kind of explaining the fact that I want shit to get better because of my child. Yeah, it's not even about him being an amazing dad. I'm not saying he's father of the year. It's the simple fact that my son knows this and my son is yearning for an understanding of why make it known to me and now everybody just disappeared. He deserved that. He he has the right to know. What the fuck? He can know. Why not? And if it don't work out, if shit never works out and I'm at my ends with it and nothing ever get resolved, I'm able to say, I tried this, I tried this, I tried that, I tried that, I tried that, and it didn't work out, son. I'm sorry. But, yeah, I said I need y'all help because this is uh social media. Social media is for resources. Hello. Stop making fake pages because you hate your life. Go kill yourself or bother yourself. Don't come bother other people. The fuck? Thank you, and I'm not. I'm fine with him not acknowledging me. I'm not saying he got to post my son on his page. Social media is not just for entertainment. Social media is for resources, baby. I don't know. Y'all may use it for entertainment, but it's not just for entertainment. Why do you think people got their businesses and everything on there? Why do you think people say, tag somebody that y'all know that do this or do that? Y'all being yourself up about a situation that don't even got nothing to do with y'all. Y'all can't be happy in real life. And that's got to suck. That's got to suck. It's got to suck to hate your life so much that you come to somebody else's page and talk to shit. No, I didn't sleep with his friend or his aunt. I never slept with no friend or no aunt. 
Anyway, I said what I had to say. If somebody got any way that they know that I could contact, uh, <laughs> any way that I could contact his mama now, I said what out of my mouth. Yeah, they want me to be an ugly, lame, bum-ass bitch so bad. Who y'all just don't know how much time I got to block y'all because I will stop everything and keep y'all ass blocked. Oh, shit. I got a little letter too right now. <clears throat> Hold on. That probably is the reason, but I don't care because they're not friends. The fuck? He don't they don't fuck with each other. They just know each other. They he did song with his brother. Whoop de doo. They're both BDs or whatever the fuck. Oh, that shit, they not friends. Never hang hung together or nothing. His mama blocked me on Instagram. When I sent her the court papers and told her to ask him to come to court, she blocked me. It's no secret, and I'm not ashamed. I don't give a fuck. Who who on this motherfucker ain't never made a mistake? I had sex with Caper Boy. Caper Boy is Fredo Santana's brother. Dirk and Fredo Santana have done music together, been knowing each other since they was younger, but Caper Boy and Dirk are not friends. They know each other. They know each other, but they're not friends. The fuck? So all that slept with a friend, slept with an op shit, that shit don't mean nothing. I don't live by another motherfucker rules and regulations, so you can't tell me who I can't fuck with. They don't got nothing to do with my child. And that's all it is. Right. What the fuck? Why is that an exclusion? The fuck? Exactly. Whoever I fuck with don't got shit to do with my son. Hell no, nah, he ain't my other baby daddy. And we still cool. And that's the thing. We he tried to throw that out there that, that Caper Boy was my baby daddy. We I have a DNA test with Caper Boy showing 0. 0.0000. We know that. But to shut him up, we got a test. Cause I told him. And then after I got the test with Caper, we got the test with Dirk's mom. And with Dirk's mom, the percentage of my son being theirs was so fucking high. Like, stop playing. That's, like, I don't understand. We already got the test. This is weird. I'm just ready for it to be over. I don't even want to say nothing bad. I don't got nothing bad to say. Capers and Dirk are not cool. What you mean get Dirk info from Caper? Y'all just on here saying shit. Mm -hmm. 
Y'all them celebrity lawyers cost money. Them, them motherfuckers is high. And I'm not saying, because that... Y'all get me, me so mixed up. I'm about to go in here and talk to my friend. Now, this is the thing. When you come to the internet with certain situations before a person can tell their side of the story, they feel like it's better not to say nothing because they feel like you done already tried to bash them. I may have said a few things over the top that I shouldn't have said just out of frustration and emotion, but I I never meant, I never had ill intentions. Like, my point is, I'm an angry mother just helping her son, but that's how I felt in the beginning when I first went public because why do y'all keep hurting my son's feelings? Why do y'all keep telling him, okay, y'all in Chicago for a birthday party, visiting family and everything, and I'm in Chicago with my son, and you saying while we in Chicago, we going to meet up, y'all going to get him, and and stuff is going to happen. So when y'all don't show up, and my son is like, oh, mommy, you know, I thought I was going with my grandma. I thought my grandma was going to get me, and I'm like, hey, we in Chicago. We at my daddy house. What, you know, when... Oh, well, um, we don't have, uh, well, uh, we might not be able to see him. Okay, well, why are y'all telling my son y'all gonna see him and then y'all not seeing him? Now I'm stuck trying to answer the questions like, I don't know, son. And I'm not that type of mama like, fuck them, they some liars, you can't see them, da 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 I'll be just like, son, I don't know, something came up, you're not gonna be able to see them. But that hurts his feelings. The fuck? And I got to keep figuring out ways to think of why y'all on this bullshit. Like, I got to keep... I'm tired of just... And I know how I look to other people, but I don't care. This is really me trying to get to him. Please, the fuck? What you want me to put Romeo on here crying? Like, damn. Oh, thank you. Demo Law 77. Can you please send that to my um can you please send his Facebook information to my inbox, please? Bang, let me let me see. No, Romeo was the fourth kid. It's Angelo. Bella, Zayden, then Romeo. Yeah, Angelo, Bella, Zayden, Romeo. Then uh, the other little babies. It is something he got against me, and I'm cool with that. He can hate me for the rest of his life. <clears throat> me and Dirk don't ever have to talk or see each other. I'm willing to talk to India. She signed the right. She the big dog of the house. I get it. I get it. You're she's she's the woman of the you know what I'm saying? I'm willing to talk to her about getting my son communication. I don't ever have to talk to Dirk, see Dirk, none of that. I don't give a fuck about none of that because I don't want him. I don't want him. But we got to make some type of peace with it. That's all I want. Oh, y'all keep talking about court and social media. I just want y'all to have a good day. Because y'all day seems to be real fucked up. <laughs> I know, friend. I know. Oh, my God. Nobody shading her. Y'all being weird. <laughs> Why are y'all so upset about something that don't got nothing to do with y'all? I don't get it. Ain't no force. Ain't no force. 
Thank you. <laughs> they want me to be a bad person so bad. Honey, they yeah, <laughs> they definitely clowning in the comments, and I don't give one fuck. Thank you. I got a way to do more interviews. I just be choosing not to talk to everybody. And people hit me up all the time asking me to talk on their platforms. But I be feeling like I get on here and say too much as it is. <laughs> y'all stop y'all is crazy what is wrong i want to hug all the mad people can i hug y'all because y'all is mad Uh-uh, don't take 6 9 on here. This ain't even that type of party. Uh-uh. <laughs> Y'all is the most hilarious people in here. I was about to go to my friend's house, but I'm finna go pick my kids up. I mean, it's definitely pressure. I'm definitely pressure in the situation. But I'm done being sh stressed about it. Send me the uh the day I I need somebody to send me the daddy Facebook page so I can um reach out um, when I get off here. Yeah. <laughs> Y'all got 
gotta stop being so mean. I don't remember nobody saying it. Okay, somebody say somebody sent me to say the face the Facebook page so I could screenshot it real quick. Do y'all I wish y'all could see how fast all these comments is upload how fast these comments is uploading because I can't even catch everything. talking to y'all driving again because y'all just act like a motherfucker just irresponsible about their life all uh, because um the live is rolling i'm not typing no comments y'all worry too much uh-uh who was that talking about you on roosevelt you need to be quiet <laughs> Yeah, of course everybody wants to stay on his good side. He he making money. That's all they care about. That's all people care about these days is money. Don't nobody got a good heart no more. Not in this fucked up world. my whole low. Glad I ain't hiding from nobody. I don't do bad things for bad things to happen to me. I live, I try to live a righteous life, baby, because my kids is a reflection. Only thing a motherfucker can say that I do is shake my ass for money. That's, I mean, what? I can't help it. If it I mean, I try to make money so many other ways, but the life I live with three kids, I'm willing to do what it takes to, you know, make it happen. That's all. Uh-uh, who's talking about? Come pick you up. Oh, my baby outside. Hi, mamas. Where's Romeo? Romeo is gone. You want you want me to pick them up? You we finna go home. No. What is it? I can't tell you, it's a secret. Hey, sister girl. I brought you a real pretty dress. You want to wear a dress? Huh? You want to wear a dress? Skirt. I want, I want the prettiest skirt. Okay, and do a you want one. Do you want to wear hair ball, hair ball balls or you want braids? Oh, I love when I catch y'all talking shit. Y'all just give me. 